how do you like this home crowd? I mean, you get the call, home crowd. What would that feel like for you coming out of the tunnel? I'll tell you what, it was, it was amazing. Just hearing the roaring, the fans, the chants, everything. And then when you walk out, see the bright lights, see the whole stadium filled, it was a, it was a great one. I loved it. Describe your, your battle this spring. Uh, Coach has said you've worked your way onto the team. You've got to feel proud. But what's that feel like for you, this journey? Um, it's still continuing, you know? Not everybody gets to say they continue to grind like this. And I'm happy to just be here and be a part of this team, be a part of this club and everything. Talk about this match tonight, just how it differed from the first half, kind of a grind into the second half, but it was a battle for, from your position. Yeah, yeah, it was, uh, it was a game where we had to get the win, had to get the result, and um, like you said, first half, we started off, we didn't get that goal, but second half, we came out, fired. We um, ended up finding that quite a few times, but um, they kept coming at us, but we stayed controlled and we kept playing well. Were you surprised in any way uh, by the physicality of, Con of CONCACAF Champions League? No. I mean, I've expected it. I was ready for it, and as you see, the whole team was. What was it like, sort of baptism by fire for you? You work your way onto the team. Kelvin gets hurt almost immediately, and sure enough, you're starting on the road first game in El Salvador in Champions League. Yeah, it's uh, it's unfortunate he didn't get hurt because he's a good player and he's someone I've been trying to learn from since he's been here, and he's got a lot of experience. But um, it's been uh, it's been interesting as well. I mean, it's good to get out there. You know, sometimes you just gotta get thrown into it, get your feet wet, and get going. And I think it's been good so far. What do you think about Coach Schmetzer? I think he's a good coach. He's a, <laughs> he's a great coach. How'd the game change uh, from your perspective after Will Bruin's goal? Um, you can tell that the uh, looks in everybody's eyes was, it was like, all right, yes, we finally got our goal, but let's keep going. And you can see that everybody was so determined to just keep going, keep pushing, because we didn't want to let up a goal. That's the big thing at the end of the day. We don't want to let them score, especially at our home.